Hey, look at us. Look at us. Huh? Who would have thought? Not me. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to bleach my hair, which was totally not completely planned, but here we go. So I'm going to use this Salon Care 30 Volume Developer and my favorite L'Oreal Quick Blue Bleach because it works best with my hair. And of course, you're going to need some gloves and some clips to separate your hair. Keep in mind, I'm filming a TikTok as I'm making this, so uh, you guys should follow me on TikTok if you have one. So yeah, this is me. I ended up using the full tub of bleach, which I didn't think I was going to need, but I ended up needing all of it and um, all of my developer. Fun fact, I ran out of developer around when I was starting to do the roots, so I had to go get another developer while I was doing this, which was kind of a pain in the butt, but uh, here we are. I mean, it, you'll see how it turns out in a second. I will admit this is not my best bleaching video because it doesn't look very professional but you know what uh we were going for speed this time i did not use a brush i think i used a brush on the first stroke but that was it And then once you do the ends of your hair, you're supposed to go back and do the roots because those process the fastest. So you don't want to do the roots while you're doing the rest of your hair because they will be a lot lighter than the rest of your hair. And that's about it. So we're going to see the results here and I'm going to show you me using some purple shampoo, which is supposed to take out the yellow tones of your hair. How is it that I could never get my hair to go like pale yellow? I'm not gonna re-bleach my hair, but I am gonna try this Fanola No Yellow Shampoo. And this says that to apply to wet hair and then wash out after one to five minutes, which is what I'm gonna do. Um, I've never used it before. It smells kind of funny, uh, but I've heard this is like one of the best yellow shampoos and I'm just gonna a whole bunch to my head it's supposed to take out the yellow tones so depending on how this turns out is gonna be how or what color I end up doing my hair um, because I kind of have two ideas of what I want to do so we'll see hopefully it takes out a lot of the yellow because I really want to do a split dye but I can't if it's not light enough or at least I don't think I can if it's not light enough so we'll see If the color ends up looking kind of cool, I might keep it for a few days. I don't know. We'll 
we'll see. I've never tried purple shampoo like this uh, before. I've only used it, I think, on my wigs. So, <laughs> we'll see how this turns out. Okay, good news, I did not get any of the purple shampoo onto my laptop that's still behind me, but I should probably move it at some point. This probably isn't my best bleaching tutorial. If you wanna see a good one, like, you should go see that other video because I look a hot mess. And this is what my hair looks like right now. I haven't looked at it yet, so I don't know how much the yellow came out. Which doesn't seem to be a lot, if any. So, cool, and I still have soap in my hair. Oh my God, I feel like I was washing that out for an hour. <laughs> okay, so. I need to go wash that out some more. Oh my God, it took so long. You know, I'm gonna go check it out in different lighting and see how I feel. And then come back. 